England emerging for this Hello crucial everybody. group game here, the tournament still in its relative infancy, but it is already developing into quite a spectacle, and that, of course, is what you expect from this, the greatest of all the tournaments. It has been terrific stuff so far, so let us hope that the trend continues here and now. And we have in front of us this gloriously imposing arena, absolutely perfect for a game of this nature. And we're underway. Denmark ran themselves into the proverbial cul-de-sac there. Over to the left. Who do you think this turns on, Jim? Yeah, Jordan Pickford. He's a great all-round goalkeeper, Peter. Uh, great at shot stopping and dominant in his box. He also gets counter-attacks going with his accurate long passes. The opposition should be a little wary of committing too many men forward to attack because if it does break down, this guy... And the shot! Superb goal! Listen, the big names earn their reputations for precisely the reason we've just seen. They have a habit of making their presence felt, and here we are, early stages. He struck one, and he looks hungry for more. Perfect placement, the one place the keeper couldn't reach. Well, Peter, I think the keeper knew straight away he was never going to get to it. They have what they wanted, the first breakthrough. Menu, Bellingham, Palmer, skillfully cut out, he is so at ease on the ball. The pressing's intense and it's paid off. Played out to the left flank, Foden. Well, he certainly wasn't in the mood to take any risks. Rice. Played out to the right. Hit into the middle. That's a decent clearance. England have hit the front early, a foothold in the game. Well, it's one thing planning it, Peter, but another executing it, and this is proving to be a rather fine execution. Kane! It's it! And they're at it again in double quick time! It was a great finish. He put it away with great poise, dead-eye accuracy. He had the whole picture in his head, Peter. He didn't even look at the goalkeeper. England get themselves a two-goal cushion. Well, it's been a, an absolutely fabulous spell for them, and they're starting to look unstoppable. There could be more on the way. Stones. For Rice. Menu. That's a good ball out wide. Whatever happens, that's the kind of movement which raises hope. There's a beautiful simplicity about this contest. Willing running on one side, dogged defence on the other. Palmer. Menu. Palmer. Stood up well to him there. Foot in. And they're not going to make any further progress now. Chip through. Saka's delivery. Hoiberg. Well, that tackle was certainly sturdy. And he's looking at the referee, but the referee is shaking his head. Bellingham. 
ball's come loose here. And he's there to belt it away. Challenged just a bit on the firm side. Menu And Alexander-Arnold. Palmer. Kane. Oh, he's put a shape too much on that. Ericsson. Played into space out wide. Ericsson. And he's quick to snatch it back. England heading towards the half-time break. The wind very much in their sails. And he cuts out the supply. Anderson. Ericsson. Vint. Nicely spread. Saka did well to emerge with the ball. That's a contest to keep an eye on. Palmer, Bellingham, now Mainu, Hoyland, Mainu, that is ended up in no man's land, Best there will be one minute at a time. And that is going to be the final action of the first half. See your views on the first half. Well, it's looking pretty straightforward, Peter. They've got themselves into a, a very good position, so why dither from here when they can repeat their first half That's success first with half a, half another show of strength? England sitting pretty here at half time. 2-0 up. So off we go once more. Menu. Now it's Kane. That has been slung wide. That's a good block, but at the expense of a corner. The taker has to look for options, because an aerial supply doesn't look promising here. Absolutely there. Certainly not as big as those trying to stop them. Last-ditch defending, but that'll do. Denmark can start a counter here. And here's Kane. Hoiberg, Eriksson, Hoyland, out to the left it goes, Palmer, it's Bellingham, out to the right, Alexander-Arnold, Eriksson, Vint, distributed tidily, That is good. Super running, sharp movement. Came up against a defender, though, who was ever so determined. Showing good feet. Palmer. And the shot! It's run loose. Who's going to... He'll try from distance. And the goalkeeper watches it past. Yeah, he's disappointed with himself, but at least his boss is applauding the effort he made. And it's played forward. Gets his pass away. Oh, nicely intercepted. Palmer. The attendance for this match was 28,997. There's a sharp little ball here. He's shifting through the gears here. Bellingham. They're urging him to shoot. Kasper Schmeichel has that under control. Vestergaard. 
Oh, and they're quick to press here, right on top of them. Bellingham. Palmer. Drilled in low. Ericsson. Oh, strongly challenged there. Now it's Kane. Now it's Bellingham. He's free, he has got space. Deflected behind for a corner kick. It's their second corner of the game. And the keeper beats it away. And the volley. And he's lifted it over. A message to the wise, it's probably better to try and get him behind that defence than try that over and over. Oh, it's come loose. Foden plays it in. He sees it all the way. Oh, good read. Rice. There they go, hunting in packs. Saka producing a good steal there, showing a good level of alertness. Forward it goes. And through to the goalkeeper. No, again, there's no way through. It's a pretty loose pass. Ericsson. Wiggles his way through. Hoyland, that's good play from him. Well, that is one way to stop him. There's some great running on show here, but ultimately there was no way through. Lobbed in behind. Palmer. He's beaten the offside trap. He's found a way through. Massive lead. Oh, it looked like 3 0 for sure. Well, judging by his reaction, he clearly feels he should have made more of it, but he's looking very much like the big threat at the moment. Substitution for Denmark, number 10. So, time for change. And this one number has been on the cards for a little while. Number 18, coming on the field, number 8, Delaney. Number 5, number 11. England can consider themselves just about safe now. Palmer. Well, that looks a decent ball. Bellingham. Can he put it away? Loose ball now, and there's a chase on to retrieve it. England have really been terrific at snuffing out the threat. Now for something different. Bellingham, and it's played into the middle. Now looking to orchestrate a counter. That looks a cracking ball. Foden. That's an excellent interception. Hoiberg. Oh, the ball's gone astray. And the assistant referee rightly gives him offside. Well, the referee's pulled play back and has booked him for the original offence. Substitution. And just to confirm that the referee did issue a yellow card for that earlier incident. Two added minutes has been indicated. Time added on will be two minutes. Thinks one through. Watkins. Referee looks at his watch and blows his whistle. 
It's a super show all round. Both sides doing their best to impose themselves, but one evidently, undeniably better equipped than the other. Well, after all of that, Jim, what are you thinking? England were victorious here, and rightly so. When you're allowed free licence to strut your stuff in wide positions, we could only see one winner. This is a performance that hasn't just got my approval. Listen. So many Unlucky thanks to Jim Beglin. That's all we have time for. Good evening to you.